Alright, welcome back to Ghost Preparedness. In today's video, we are going to talk about what we're going to do in the event that ammo runs out. Because, let's face it, at some point, ammo is going to run out. When the world ends and nobody's producing any more ammo and you have to start relying on what you have stocked up and, you know, depending on what type of situation you're in, you could easily burn through everything that you had stocked up. Like, that's not an impossible situation. Now, it's not going to happen the day after, you know the day after the world ends, you know, it's going to take a few years to really start going into effect. Like, unless if you have, like, five rounds stocked up, it's going to take a couple years. Or if you're in a constant gunfight every single day, I mean, chances are it's going to take a few years before you start noticing that, hey, there's, like, really no ammo left. So what do you do? Because you still have to sit there and think about how you're going to protect yourself, how you're going to hunt, how you're going to, you know, whatever. Because, you know, guns and ammo are a pretty good way to do all that. So what do you do when you have nothing? When you are out, when you are out of ammo, you have nothing else, what do you do? Me personally, I would stock up on things like crossbows and bows. Two really great options for hunting, not necessarily home defense. I mean, I, I, I'm sure it could be done, but on a hunting level, bows and crossbows. They're initially expensive, but, you know, you could sit there and build up a pretty good stockpile of uh, the bolts and arrows. Now, with that one, it does kind of fall in line of, at some point, all that's going to be gone. But, at least, if you don't severely damage the bolt or arrow, you can reuse it a few different times. So, you kind of got that going for you. Um, outside of bows and crossbows, you have items like hand axe. You know, I have more, like tactical hand axe uh, let's put this back in here before we continue uh, fixed blade knives or my favorite go to is just like a regular axe you know items like this it's kind of like it's one of those things is like oh I'm gonna go like medieval on your ass and just charge into battle with a axe and sword and whatever but when you have nothing left and you have to sit there you have an intruder or somebody is like trying to steal from you or attack your community and tribe and you have no ammo well sometimes you have to use items like you know axes or swords or whatever and, you know go a little medieval on this situation but it's not a, like, sitting there buying this or, you know, an axe isn't a waste of money. Like, you can use those items for more than just, you know, defending your home and going all Braveheart or whatever. You know, homesteading. You could use an axe, collect firewood, whatever. You know, there's so many different purposes that you can use an axe for that it's not necessarily meant to protect yourself. Um, coming down to, like, knives and axes like this, I don't personally think I would use this axe to process wood. This would be more of, like, a uh, somebody's, like, invading your tribe, your community, whatever. That's about the only thing I would use this one for. But yeah, it is something I think people should take into consideration, because even though it's like kind of like a, oh, hey, yeah, funny, you know, I'm not going to go into battle with an axe in, you know, 21st century, but at the end of the day, people should probably consider the possibility of ammo running out, and what are you going to do when the ammo runs out and the material to reload everything runs out? You know, like I said, it's not going to happen the day after, but after a few years, like 10, 15, 20 years goes by, 
you know, you're, the chances of ammo becoming very, very hard to find becomes a very good possibility. So, st or, I want to say stocking up. Like, I don't really think you need an arsenal of hand axes or regular axes. But I would say sit there and spend a little bit of money. Get yourself some nice little axes, good quality ones. And, you know, to have them on standby. You know, use them to collect firewood, whatever. You don't have to just use it to protect yourself and, you know, going all medieval and shit. But yeah, that's kind of just the gist of this video. Um, something that, in the back of my head, something to consider. I think a lot of people should consider the possibility as to what they're going to do if that situation ever occurs. Um, me personally, I'll go with uh, uh, melee weapons. They're easy to get a hold of. You don't need a license. You don't need to sit there and wait five hours to get it, you know, it's something you can have on standby. Plus, you know, you can sit there and look like a Viking charging after somebody with an axe, whatever. But just my personal preference, my personal opinion. So, if you like the video, hit the like button. If not, feel free to hit the dislike button. Comment below your thoughts and opinions, what you would stock up on or purchase in the event of ammo running out. Throw it in the comment section. But other than that, that's all I have. Um, I've got a few videos coming out today on this channel and the other channels. So, yeah, it's going to be a productive day. So, have a wonderful day.